Well, good Tuesday morning to you folks. Hopefully things are going well with you. I hope you had a good night's rest and you are ready to face the day. I, uh, I'm going to read to you from the book of Matthew in chapter 9, something no doubt we've read before, but maybe it'll be something you need today. We see here that Jesus is being pressed on by the multitudes and uh, Jairus' daughter uh, is sick and will eventually die. And this leader of um, the Jews comes to Jesus, uh, a ruler, and, um, and asks him to come to his home and heal his daughter. In verse 20 it says, Behold, a woman which was diseased with an issue of blood twelve years came behind him and touched the hem of his garment. For she said within herself, If I may but touch his garment, I shall be whole. But Jesus turned him about, and when he saw her, he said, Daughter, be of good comfort. Thy faith hath made thee whole. <laughs> and the woman was whole from that very hour. In the other Gospels, when we read this story, one writer says um, like this, that Jesus immediately stopped and he asked who touched him. And uh, the, the disciple said, Lord, um, look at all these people around you and you're asking who touched you, but he said, but there had went out virtue from him. This woman was bleeding to death slowly for 12 years and unclean, considered to be unclean with this blood. Um, no doubt felt like an outcast, spent everything that she had. It doesn't say how much she had, but for a 12-year period, everything that she had, she spent it all and was no better. Someone told her about Jesus, and she said, if I can touch the hem of his garment, that's all I need. I don't have to talk to him. I don't have to uh, look in his eyes. He doesn't have to say anything to me if I can just touch the hem of his garment. And so she had the faith to believe that if she did that, she would be whole. Well, it was that faith, the scripture says, that made her whole. And, um, you know, I can't always say that when someone isn't healed, it's because they didn't have faith. I can't always say that, but I can say that if you are going to be healed, you've got to have faith um, of anything. Without faith, the scripture says it's impossible to please God, of course. Um, this song is called Thread of Hope, and sometimes we feel as if that we're just barely hanging on, but God knows your need today. Whatever it is, he knows your need. The woman needed healing of that dreaded disease. Her money brought physicians, but only Jesus could bring relief. Though her last thread of hope, it was worn down. Her heart held on to faith Till she could touch him with her hand When you're hanging by a thread Still you can climb life's mountains Though the cliffs are up and jagged You can go if you should slip and reach ropes in, you'll find the hem of his garment. So don't let go of that last thread of hope. Is it you hanging on to afraid and fragile faith? Are you clinging to the rocks above a canyon of dismay? Reach out for the lifeline, it will never break into. Hold fast, don't lose heart, for once again he'll pull you through. If you're hanging by a thread, still you can climb 
life's mountain Though the cliffs are rough and jagged You can go If you should slip and reach ropes in You'll find the hem of his garment So don't let go of that last thread of hope. You should slip and reach ropes in You'll find the hem of his garment So don't let go of that last thread of hope. Lord, as we come to you, God, I know that there's a potential um, that this word spoken today speaks to people who are in need, who feel as if they're about to lose hope. And God, I pray that you will speak to them today, not my words, but your words, Lord. We love you and we thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you, folks. Have a great day. We'll see you Wednesday.